Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to the Southern Snack in this video, Papa John's Deluxe Cheese Crispy Parm Pizza Review. This is the second new one that he uploaded yesterday and I'm gonna react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. Hello and welcome back to the Southern Snack, where life is too short to be serious. The pizza places are staying busy. They are absolutely popping off right now for good reason. Uh, if you've been to Little Caesars, they've got some new uh, pepperoni and jalapeno sticks, things, that cheese sticks. Those are really good. Um, you know, a lot of the smaller pizza places also doing some things. Papa Murphy's doing a New York style pizza. Donato's has some new cheese sticks. Very interesting stuff on those ends. And then the big reviews, Pizza Hut brought back their New York style pizza. Six slices, big old slices with pepperoni, cheese, all your fixins. Uh, Papa John's, I believe they brought back their shakaroni pizza, something. Well, we're at Papa John's. So discard that. I don't even know if they still have that. But their big thing is the Parmesan crusted pizza plus some new Papa Bites. And then Domino's, I really hope that they align themselves with the Super Bowl with their new tater tot appetizers. You would think that they would do that. We'll have to see, keep our eyes peeled, but it wouldn't make any sense for them to do it later in February amidst this big window, this big Super Bowl window. So anyways, lots of things going on. You may not have wanted to hear about all that, but here I am telling you about it because I care about you. I'm a foodie. And maybe you are too. Anyways, hit that subscribe button, like, and comment on the video. We're going to go ahead and pose for the thumbnail. I did take a piece of pizza and flip it over already. So that's why it's flipped over so you can see the big old uh, crust here. So it's that uh, Parmesan crust of pizza. It's Parmesan and Romano cheeses on the bottom. It's a two cheese uh topping don't don't know what i mean you would think it's all mozzarella i guess not uh marinara and asiago no uh what's that not asiago is it i keep it alfredo alfredo sauce so there's the pizza here's me me smiling smiling don't make me happy don't mean i'm happy it just means i'm smiling okay smiles are just smiles all right so we're going to take our piece of pizza, take a good look. Looks like it's got a good amount of garlic and herbs on there. So, and again, look at the back of this piece of pizza, and we're going to try it. it quite a bit it's a thin crust but not like a crispy thin crust it's thin in the way of its thickness but it keeps to that typical pizza texture where it's kind of chewy and softer it really lets the cheeses come all together and it feels like a five cheese type of thing i know it's like four cheeses or is it? You got Alfredo, a two cheese, um, you know, top, and then two cheeses on the bottom. It might actually be five cheeses. Which would have made for an interesting name, too. But they wanted to emphasize the crust, which does have a very cheesy flavor. It's nothing groundbreaking, but it is quite flavorful. And again, if you love cheese, this one will please you quite a bit. You may even want to take a next step and tell them to leave the marinara out, put some extra Asiago. That would really be a cheesy delight, wouldn't it? down easy doesn't hit too heavy and it's quite flavorful i wouldn't say this is groundbreaking again it's not the most amazing thing you'll ever eat but i think it's quite enjoyable and for that i'm going to say seven and a half i was thinking about eight but i'm going to give it a seven and a half um 
quite enjoyable. I would say it's, it's worth it. I don't even remember how much I paid for this. I'm sorry. But 400 sli- calories in a slice, that's surprising. For how thin it is, that is really surprising. But I could probably eat this whole thing without even feeling any regret. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this review. And go try this out. Yee-yee! Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my main channel or my second channel or the Southern Snacks channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post. And share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my main channel, we are on the road to 7,000 subscribers. And on my second channel, we are on the road to 2,000 subscribers. And please don't forget to take a look at my other videos on my channel's playlists on both my main channel and my second channel and give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me accomplish my goal to get 7,000 subscribers or more on my main channel and 2,000 subscribers or more on my second channel too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate that too. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my main channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the two playlists that are on my main channel and give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too please everybody I would really definitely appreciate that and please help me bring my subscriber count up on my main channel as well also please everybody I would really appreciate that too please everybody please please everybody please and I'm off now so until next time see ya